if you cannot hook up the Wi-Fi bird box can merge to your Wi-Fi network. Here you can try the software on the Mac. First, we need to go to the Wi-Fi setting of the current Wi-Fi. This is our home Wi-Fi. So we need to check the TCP IP and the sub rate and the rotor is 192, 168, 1 and 1. Okay, we need this information later. We will input similar information to the camera. Okay, now we have to connect the camera, uh, sorry, connect the Mac to our camera's Wi Fi. Once the camera boots up, it will create a uh, access point, allow the, like the laptop or mobile phone to connect directly. So, this is the camera's access point. If you don't see this camera's Wi Fi, you, can, you need, may need to reset the camera. Then depress three times to turn on the camera's Wi-Fi. Now we just connect the camera's Wi-Fi. The password is one two three four five six eight nine eight one. Okay, click John. Now you see the map is connected to the camera directory. Now we click the S. Login. Here we find the device manager. We need to add the camera to this software. Click search. Now, if you don't see, you may need to click search again. Here is the camera's IP address. You click add to the camera. So we see the status become connected, which means the software has connect the camera directory. Now we go to the live. We double click the camera's name. Here we are seeing the live video from the camera. All right, now we need to go to the camera setting and add the password of our home network so the camera can change the change to the home network. All right, we click config and we find the network. Here we Turn to the full screen and the last one. Okay, we click search. Now this is the cameras, the Wi-Fi access point the camera scene now. We choose the home Wi-Fi we want to add. And here we need to input the password. Remember, this is the password of your home network, it's not the password of the camera. And here we need to manually configure the IP address. That's the reason why we just got to see the current network perf preference. So the sub ring subnet one, you can pick any IP address. And here is correct, correct. And now we click OK. We click take a few seconds. And the camera will remove and try to connect to our Wi-Fi network. See time now is OK. Then let's check. Just after a few seconds, you will see the connection will, dis uh, will dis disappear. Okay, now let the Mac which has connected to our current Wi-Fi network. All right, we go back to the device manager. Here we remove. Then we search again. You need to wait for a few seconds for the camera to remove. Right now, the camera pops up. This is the camera we just we have add to our Wi-Fi network. Currently, the Mac connecting to our Wi-Fi, not the camera. So we collect, we add the camera back to the app. Here we double click. Alright, now the camera come back. Okay, that's all. Thanks for watching.